أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم What do you believe? Tell me what you yeah. believe. Tell me the I foundations did. of your belief. We didn't. Is it Baphomet? Who's yeah. Baphomet? Okay, so Baphomet is another deity alongside with God. Where, where, where do you get that idea from? Uh, Dante's Inferno. And a nice, What's Dante's Inferno? It's uh, our doctrine. A what? Our doctrine. And where did doctrine come from? Who wrote that? Dante Alighieri. Who? Dante Alighieri. And who's Dante Alighieri? He is an Italian poet. Right, and why do you believe what he says? Because he's a prophet. Why do you believe that? Because what he uh, wrote came from Baphomet, and when he wrote it down, afterwards he couldn't read it, and his scribes had to read it to him. Why do you believe that? Huh? Why do you believe that? It's what's written down in the uh, cantos afterwards. Well, what, look, why do you believe it's true? Because he couldn't read it afterwards, so what he wrote down has to be from something else. So he wrote it down? Yeah. And, and how do you know he couldn't read it afterwards? Because it says in the cantos and by his biography, Discovery... That no, how do you know it's true? Afterwards. What are you saying? I'm telling you why it's true. No, you're just telling me you read it's true. Why do you believe it's true? Well, do you, read it? do you believe everything you read? No, of course not. Well, you believe in this, why are you believing in it? Yeah, because he couldn't read what was written down afterwards. How do you know he couldn't read it? Because <laughs> it says it and there's proof that he couldn't read it afterwards. What's proof? Proof that when he wrote it, right, his scribes, they wrote their own books as well after him, that he didn't know what he wrote down that No, night. no, what's the proof for him not knowing? What's, he couldn't read it afterwards. No, what's the proof that he couldn't read it afterwards? <laughs> Uh, in loads of like cantos afterwards it's him described as he can write poems he can read it all fluently and everything but it's one thing that he wrote he couldn't understand right and he scribes had to say it back to him well he scribes could read it yeah what language is it in? Italian so could he write Italian yes so he could write Italian yeah he wrote something in Italian he couldn't read yes and you believe that one? yes why it's the same like moral belief that Muhammad was illiterate. Oh, it is because he had scribes write it down for him. No, it's not. How is it? Not? How is it not? Uh, how does an illiterate man come up with the Quran? By uh, citing it to his scribes. Where's the information from? You believe it's from Allah. But where do you believe it's from? Well, in Islam, it's believed to be from well, where Allah. Where do you believe it's from? I don't believe in the Quran. No, no. So where do you believe the information from, from Muhammad? Sorry. Where do you believe the information come from? Well, Allah. You believe that? Well, yeah, I believe that, but I don't believe the Quran is, you know, the truth. So you don't believe it's from Allah? I believe that it's from Allah because it says it is, but I don't think it's. No, the you, truth. Say, you can't say I believe it's from Allah, but I don't believe it is. It's, 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 no, it's like saying, so I know what was written down, written down about it, and I know how he got it. No, but I'm asking you and what you believe about it. Oh, what I believe. Okay. Yeah. yeah, so I believe that that happened, yeah. Well, you, no, you don't believe it's from Allah, do you? Yeah, of course I do. You do believe it's from Allah? Because it's what it said. Okay, so do you believe in uh, the Hindu scriptures as well? No. Why not? Because I don't. I don't believe in Islam or Hinduism. Well, you, you believe things you read are true? No, I don't. You're saying, why do I think Allah... Okay, make it easy for you. Do I believe the Bible's the word of God? No. Whether you believe it is or not is irrelevant to what I believe. Okay. Okay. So, why do you, who do you believe um, is the source of the Quran? Um, well, Allah. Well, you don't believe that, though? That's what it says, though. But you don't believe that, though? No. Right. So who do you believe it was? I believe it's the word of God, right? But I don't believe... You believe the Quran's the word of God? <sighs> but I don't believe it's the right religion. Do you, is it the word of God? To your beliefs, yeah. No, to you. Do you believe it? I do believe in God. Okay. No, no, no. Quite in the problem. Sorry. I, I, honestly, I'm trying to... See, uh, here's the problem I have, you see. When people go off a logical path, yeah. I can't deal with them. Okay. I'll be honest with you. Not can't deal with them, but... Um, Oh, it's too hard and difficult for me. It can't be asked. Yeah, because you can't have a rational conversation with somebody who is not speaking logic. I'm trying, but you're making it so you're make, make, you're derailing the whole conversation, right? No, now. no, no, no. You are. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm, I'm on point. I'm exactly where I want to be on the conversation. I'm saying that it's written in the Quran, right? That Allah gave Muhammad the word for his scribes to write down. I believe no, that. Not. What What does it say about it then? So the point here is this. Yeah. What do you believe? What do I believe? With regards to the Quran. What do you believe in regards to the Bible? Um, there is the words of men, and it's been, been added to over time, mm. and there may have been uh, echoes of truth within it, but man has corrupted the message from it. 
Okay. I don't believe it's the word of God. And whether a Christian believes it is the word of God, it doesn't really matter to me. Yeah, see, what you believe about something doesn't affect what I believe about that same thing. Oh, okay. Now, the way you're working it is yeah. that you're, you're, you're saying your belief about the Quran is the same because of my belief about the Quran, which isn't. It's easier with brain washing. Brain cleansing, mate, brain cleansing. Cleaning the crap out. Yeah. It's right, technically, it's washing. Washing it. Yeah, washing it. Take it there. What? No documents. Or what, what are you talking about? Religion. What are you talking about? <laughs> what are you doing here? What are you doing here? Go and enjoy your Sunday. Go and enjoy your Sunday. What are you doing here? What's Why are you wasting here? your time here? Go and enjoy your Sunday. Go and enjoy your Sunday. Go eat, drink, and be merry. YOLO. I see this young man. Don't let him pain wash you. You know he worships Satan. Satan doesn't exist. He worships Satan. No, he worships Satan. Satan and uh, God say. No, he, he, he worships Satan. <laughs> I can bring my somebody. He worships Satan. Should I allow him to keep believing that thing? <laughs> you got stuck. Oh! <laughs> Learn to be quiet. You win, you then you won't look stupid. Yeah, Wake up. Are you a good human being? I'm sorry. Are you a good man? Inshallah. Inshallah. Alhamdulillah. Yeah. Yeah. Are you a good man? I try. I, I am. What's your standard of good? I, I don't hate people. What's, what's your standard you, of good? I don't hate you. I don't care whether you hate me or not. I don't have enemies. I don't call the kuffar and the mushriki. Sorry, is he in the park? Oh, sorry, I, I, didn't, I didn't realize you're a pigeon in the park. I didn't realize I you're a pigeon you in the park. I you are Serbian. Are you Serbian? You're also dog Serbian. What makes you Islam anymore? I'll just continue with the conversation. What makes you Islam anymore? Look, understand one thing. Everything's organic. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's in the way. So anyway, Islam that's all you have only religion. Otherwise, you will explore. Have your religion and enjoy. And once you die, and you go to sleep, you find out. Turn it back to him. Who told you that? Turn it back to him. There we go. <laughs> Who told you that? You only have this enemy. Who told you that? I cannot stop. Who told you that? That's part of us. Leave it. Humanity, you've got to have hope. What makes you Islam credible? No, not pessimistic one like that's you. What's that? The what makes you Islam credible? What do you mean credible? You are, you are convert. What do you mean credible? You know what anyone means? No, you tell me. You don't know what anyone means? No, you tell me what you mean by your question. The reason... What, what makes it sound true? The reason to accept the teaching of Islam. That means credible. What makes you Islam credible? What makes Islam true? Credible. What do you mean by what? Acceptable? What do you mean what makes it acceptable? The Quran, the Prophet Muhammad, the teachings, the guidance. What makes it acceptable? What makes it acceptable? Is he a pigeon? Is he a pigeon? Can we continue? Give me a paper. I will deal with it. I'll deal with everything. Right? I. I don't know where the conversation goes. Yeah, I don't see him as a heckler. I don't see him as a pigeon in the park at the moment. He looks to me. Yeah, we're going to get into him. He's already irrational. I'm already kind of. Do you get me? But we'll get to it. We'll get to it. He looks to me. That he's asking the wrong questions. Is what he's doing. He's making me go off topic. I, I, That's what's happening. Credible. You understand credible What do you mean I'm asking the wrong question? You're going off topic. Oh, you're so you're, script for me. No, you're saying you're, you're making the question so hard to understand that you're completely derailing which the whole conversation. Which question did I ask you that you, you believe, couldn't understand? You believe, right? Which, which question okay. did I ask you? That you was said, so complicated you couldn't understand it. Okay, first of all, you don't have to be rude about it. There's no need for that. I mean, direct. No, there's no need for it. Well, that's how I Just am. Just like you was with Apus. That's how I am. Why are you rude for me? I'm not rude. I'm you direct. Are. When someone starts being irrational with me, there was I start no, thinking there was I'm no wasting my time or not. There was no rationality. There was. No, it wasn't. It's not. Why can't we have a normal conversation like I did with Ali? Listen, listen. Believable. 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 If you want to have a conversation, we can have a conversation. Yeah. Yeah. I don't play by your rules. I play by my rules. Okay. Right? So it's very, very simple. I ask a question. There should be, shouldn't be any rules. Then. We should yeah, just sure. be having a normal conversation. I care, I care about you. This nonsense you believe. I want to try to understand it. And you're kind of waffling. And I'm Disrespect trying to bring it back again. on point. 
Yeah. I'm not coming here and saying See, Islam is nice to am I? Ali was nice to you. Yeah. Because right? we had a normal conversation. I, 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 he's still a Satanist. Yes. So the point of conversation. Because he's not. He's teaching me about the Quran. No, you need this. I respect. Him, I respect him more than you. Yeah. It doesn't. You still a Satanist. Yeah. Still worshiping Satan. Yeah. Right. So Ali, as nice as he was with you. Yeah. He's still a Satanist. I would have a more in-depth conversation. You don't know how you're him. gonna feel after I finish with you. I do. Because right now you're being disrespectful. You're calling it nonsense. It is nonsense. I'm not coming here and f throwing the Quran on the ground. No, no, no. I? But I am saying to you, you worshiping Satan. Yeah. It's nonsense. Okay, but you haven't heard my point of view, though. Uh, from my my own position, it's nonsense right now. It's what you do. I'm, so I'm trying it's to understand it. Yeah. I've, I've seen you. Right. On Ham, your Hamza, right. you've had a debate with Apus and two other... I, I didn't have a debate you with Apus. You did. And two, what was my two debate with Apus about? Let's deal with that. Let's yeah. deal with the... It, it the was the 4v1. It was 4v1? Yeah. What was, the, what was the debate? The Kaaba. What was the debate? The Kaaba. And what about it? The historical evidence of that. And what about it? And what, what is it? And what was the conclusion? That he won. He won? Yeah. On which point did he win? He just won the whole thing because you got angry. So give me an ex... You got angry? Yes, you did. Uh, no, I didn't. Yes, you did. Okay, so remind me of the point he won on. In a half hour, Mark. Remind me of the point he won. That there's no historical evidence of it. There is not. No. Okay. So does Apus actually believe in the existence of Abraham? I don't know what he believes in. No, he doesn't. Okay. He, he, he doesn't believe in the existence but this, of Abraham. This is how you have debates, so, though, right? No, no, no. No, it is, it is. Because no, you just shout at him. Listen, it was listen, a 4v1 I've and you still lost. I've had beautiful conversations today. 4v1 and you still lost. How do you do that? Today. How do you do that? Right. Do what? 4v1 and still lose. You remind me what I lost about. You lost. Give me something. Because you got angry. Because I got angry, I got lost. Yes. Why did I get angry? How did I get angry? Because you're saying what he's saying is nonsense, but you're not letting him talk, uh, no, no, answer no. the question. Which point did he make that was accurate? M mainly all of them. Name one point. Did you not watch the debate? Did you watch him afterwards Just refute him? Did you name him refute afterwards? Just name the point. Do you believe Joseph built the Kaaba? Do I believe who built the Kaaba? Joseph. Who? Joseph. Who? Joseph. No. You don't believe Joseph built it? No. So why did your okay, friend say that? No one said Joseph built the Kaaba. Your friend said that. No, they didn't. Your friend said that. No, they didn't. Nobody said that. You can look at it. Nobody said Joseph built the Kaaba. Yeah, they did. No, they didn't. Nobody said Joseph. If you built look the back at the debate, Hamza, you can see it. Nobody made the claim that Joseph built the Kaaba. Have you have you seen his video refuting it? Which one? His video afterwards. Uh, the Psalms 84 one. Yeah. Yeah. Have you seen our refutation to it? Yeah. You have. Yeah. Which part of our refutation was wrong? It's nonsense. Which part of it? Why do you believe that Psalms 84 mentions the Kaaba? Which part of Kaaba? our response was nonsense? Why do you think? No, which part? I'm asking you a question. You need a response. No, 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 no. That's how conversations work. No, no, no. I'll tell you how it works. You made a claim that our response was nonsense. So you need to support your claim now with evidence. How was it nonsense? You you believe they've done a pilgrimage to Mecca? Who? Uh, Christians. No, in Psalms 84. Psalms 84? Yeah. What's it got to do with Christians? Valley of Becca. What's it got to do with You're Christians? trying to relate that to Mecca. What's it got to do with Christians? You're trying to relate that to Mecca. What's it got to do with Christians? Because it's in the Bible. What's that got to do with Christians? Because it's in the Bible. What's Psalms 84 got to do with Christians? That's like saying, what does the Quran have to do with Muslims? No, it's not. It's, it is. What's Psalms 84 got to do with Christians?